welcome back to my channel so tonight I'm going to be filming my October favorites for you guys and it is currently October 31st it is Halloween and I just thought I'd get a little bit of a head start on this video so that I can have it up at a decent time for you guys so yeah let's just get started first we're going to ignore my makeup I just got off work so it's a little oily but I just wanted to get started on this video for you guys so yeah be quiet let's just get started <laughs> Okay guys, so for my first favorite, it's going to be my Burberry perfume. And it's literally called My Burberry. It smells heavenly, like honestly, I will list the notes below for you guys. I'm not gonna sit here and just start yelling out crazy stuff. <laughs> this smells so good. Um, I've been using it a lot and look how much is left. And I've legit been using it at least three or, two or four days out of the week. So yeah, this is bomb. I do suggest you go pick this up and they literally sell it everywhere. I did see it at Ulta recently. So yeah, it's called My Burberry. Be sure to go pick that up. And next we're going to talk about my favorite lip combos. This first one, this first lip combo was legit a game changer for me, like game changer. So I did not come up with this myself. I did see it on someone else's Instagram. But I'm going to show you, it's going to be the Colored Rain Liquid Lipstick in shade Truffle Rain, which is like a nice chocolatey brown color. So I'm not going to lie, for a while I wasn't wearing this only because I feel like it tends to like look kind of blow on me if I don't wear like a certain eye makeup. So I stopped wearing it. But with the NYX Jumbo Pencil and Milk in the center, game changer like legit game changer like you just you just dab it in the center what a difference like legit what a difference so if we have that brown lipstick that you feel like makes you look kind of blah put some white eyeliner it doesn't have to even be this any white pencil in the middle and blend it out real good that's that's all I gotta say game changer <laughs> So this next lip is going to be my Anastasia Liquid Lipstick in the shade Veronica. I did already swatch this on my hand before I started filming. Just so it can be dry and you guys can see the true shade of it. So pretty. I've been wearing this a lot and I'm not going to lie, I'm not even really into liquid lipsticks but this is nice. I do plan on doing a tutorial with this lippy so if you want to see that please subscribe to my channel. Next. Is going to be my favorite ash eyelashes of the month and they are my salon perfect this is the box here are the lashes and 614 now I did see these flying around YouTube a lot lately mainly because one they're bomb and you get them at Walmart so they come in a pack of five they're salon perfects in 614 and look just look at them you can just see how wispy they are they're long and they're they're bomb and you can find them at Walmart this may be eight or nine dollars for five pairs of lashes you guys know how expensive lashes can be so if you're looking for something that's cute and affordable 614 by who is this by the <laughs> salon perfect <laughs> next is going to be a favorite for my hair so this is the wild growth hair oil this this oil has literally made my hair so much easier to work with. I will be doing a natural hair video pretty soon, but I do have a lot of leave out out in the front. And as you can see, it does look a little thick. And I've always had a decent length of hair, but it was never really thick. Uh, but this, I have about this much left. This has made my hair so much thicker and I think I'm retaining the thickness as well, which is great. And yeah, I've heard so many great things about this. It does come in another uh, one that's similar to this, but it's yellow in the front. I did hear this wasn't the better one, but I'm not quite sure. But I got this from my local Sollies. I'm pretty sure they sell them in all the Sollies. And yeah, if you're having issues with your hair being long but thin, try this out. And this is the Wild Growth Hair Oil that you can find at Sollies. Next is also going to be for your hair. And I'm not... Listen, I'm not into spending 20, 30, anything over $10 for shampoo and conditioner. Just not gonna do it. So this is by Herbal Essence and I got this from my local Walmart. And uh, this smell, let me just. The, if you can take Skittles, Starburst, some grapes, the, which grapes? 
the purple grapes and run through like a blueberry forest. That's what this smells like. <laughs> smell any shampoo conditioner that smells like this. And I think that's what made me buy it. Like, ladies, don't go, don't go lay it with your man with your hair smelling like caca, okay? Make sure your hair smells good too. So this is bomb. And it does a great job at conditioning your hair too, so win-win. And that is Herbal Essence, and it's the Hydralicious de damage Boost Conditioner by Herbal Essence. Next, we're gonna jump right into my fashion favorites. I, I have three, three fashion favorites for you guys. So first is going to be a pair of shoes. And it's going to be these booties here. Oh, let me just do the one. So I got these booties from Agassi. I'm pretty sure they have them in a lot of states, but they do have an online store as well. I will link it below. But these boots have been like my jam this month. They have the ruching around the ankle, the heel isn't too high, and it's exposed heel. No, exposed heel, ladies. I love me an exposed heel. And the toes are out. Mmm, so cute. So, and these are from, are from Agassi. I want to say they were $32.99. And yeah, I've been loving these. And I actually have something else that's my favorite that I've been wearing with these. Just to, you know, spice it up a little. And I'll show you that in just a moment. So ladies, we, we all have those bad hair days. But a bad hair day can, should not stop you from looking cute, okay? So, just get a cute hat. So, what I, first I've been loving these suede baseball caps. I've been loving these and this one I actually wear with those heels. You know those days where you want to be cute but casual? Yep, that's what this is. This is my cute but casual look. I wear this like a cute pair of bootylicious jeans and a nice t-shirt and then I throw those heels on. Cute! So bomb. So I've been loving this and this is from Agassi as well. I got this the same time that I got those shoes. So yeah. And then this one is not really a fall color. But it's cute nonetheless. And then this one I actually got from a store at my job. It was super random. It was $5. And yeah, it's like a Tiffany blue color and I've been loving this. And yeah, get you a suede hat, throw it on. Nobody knows that your edges ain't on fleek. So yeah, I picked this up and it is a suede blue hat. <laughs> okay guys, so my next favorite, I'm actually a little embarrassed to show you. But hey, we keep it real on this channel. So it's going to be my Adidas Superstars. And as you can tell, I've been wearing them. <laughs> These just go so well with everything. Like, I literally cannot think of one thing these don't go with. And these are the white with the black stripes and the gold decal on the tongue. So cute, like. Only thing about these, I do say they get dirty really easily. They look like I've been like stomping grapes, but I haven't. I've literally just been walking around in them. But they're so cute. And I got these from Foot Locker. I got these from Foot Locker. For a while, these were hard to find, which was kind of surprising. But yeah, I wear these with everything. And these are my Adidas Superstars in white with black stripes. Okay, so we're gonna jump right into my home decor favorites. And I only have two pillows to show you guys. And yeah, I wanna say this is probably my favorite part of the video. Okay guys, so I hope, I'm going to hope that you guys have not been sleeping on your local Ross. So Ross has stepped it up. Like every time I go in there, I'm just like, take my money. You can have it, take it. <laughs> I just love raw. So my first favorite is going to be this pillow here. Isn't it just so pretty? It's gray and then on the silver part here it has some sparkle details. It is so pretty. Like you know, if you go over to, um, what's those stores called? Z Gallery or go over to Home Goods, you can easily pay 30, 40, 50, even $60 for a pillow like this, cause I've seen it. For this pillow, I paid $13.99, and I have two of them, $13.99, and it just brings some type of, it just brings so much oomph into your room. This room needs some oomph. Yeah, this room, this pillow brings some oomph into my room, and I love it, and I am going to do a room tour once I'm all finished, but yeah, I've been loving this pillow, and it is from my local Ross. I so... My next favorite is a pillow as well, and guess what it's from? Yep, you guessed it, it's from Ross. So, this pillow, 
I'm about to have to just step out of frame to show, the, show you this pillow. How big, let me just show you. This is the pillow. Just look at that. Look how, this is like a couch pillow, but it's not. I keep it on my bed and I have two of these. This pillow is just like, so let me just say, originally my room was black, white, and gray, and silver. Those were like the colors that were in my room. But I walked into Ross one day and they had everything in this color here. And I was just like, oh, there it goes. I guess I'm adding color to my room. And I just love it. So, so I have a pillow that is not even half this size that I paid $25 for. I have two of these and they were $19.99 a piece. And this is at Ross. So if you're sleeping on your Ross, you better wake up. <laughs> Go over to your local Ross. They'll have anything you're looking for there. And that is my pillow for $19.99. Okay guys, that wraps it up for my October favorites. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel, leave me a nice comment, and like this video, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.